essential to getting dressed. With my fleece joggers, with my kind of like blanket cardigan, um, you have to layer something underneath. But the t-shirts that you're wearing from summer, short sleeve, a thin weight, um, could be a real like grievous scoop neckline, or even um, too short, because they're intended not to be layering pieces. This is the perfect new today top that fills that fall void in your wardrobe of a t-shirt. But it's so much more than a t-shirt that we wouldn't dare calling it a tee. So it is a top. There's one order of the year. It's done in cotton span. Mm -hmm. It's done in kind of like that, that, um, that slub knit, because you see these soft, subtle striations in the knit when you get up close. And the colors scream autumn. So brand new and one order of the year. We are going to tell you the easy pay and the buy more and save expire at the end of today. But your first look is now the color next to Gary, dark spruce green. That's the one Crystal was in. Next to that, I'm in the black. Now, these lighter colors are where you're really, I think, going to appreciate what I just talked about with the slub. This is our light turquoise. It's a beautiful color. Stunner. Oh, my gosh. Um, would be amazing with those, those ice, mint, whatever yes. the color was, joggers. Mm -hmm. uh, this is our natural mm -hmm. uh, clay red, which you've seen quite a few times in the show already, and obviously um, not just in the joggers, but in the cardigan. So a perfect layering piece if you're making an outfit out of those items. And then here's peach sorbet. It is most limited, let it be said. Only 800 remain. Um, okay, Gare, so tell me, you gotta tell everybody about the knit. Sure. So yeah, this is, first of all, 96% cotton, 4% spandex. It's what we call textured knit. And textured knit is a, is a jersey knit where highs and lows, as we create this fabric, those highs and lows are knitted into it. So it gives you some really nice texture, uh, some service interest, but here's what it's not. It's not sheer mm -mm. and it's not see-through. It's a nice weight jersey knit fabric. And then you've got this you can see, if you come in close, you'll see those highs and lows uh, knitted in there. I think we're going to get there in a moment. There you go. Look at that. That's what it's all about. That's what we call textured knit. Now, Sean, sometimes when you go out at retail and you see these kind of slubby, you know, textured knits and, and you hold them up to the light, you can see right through right, them. Right, I know. You, if, I, if I put my hand in here, yeah. you can't see mm -hmm. anything. I mean, j just the outline of my hand. There's These are not sheer. It's a beautiful weight. And it's a beautiful weight for year round. Okay, so you, you, you need pieces like this. This is part of our Essentials brand extension. Wardrobe builders, problem solvers. Sometimes when you don't, you wake up in the morning and you're like, I don't know what to wear and I'm tired and I'm late. You put on the top like this with your favorite pant, you're out the door. Don't forget your shoes and bag, but you're out the door for the day. These are great. And I love the little bateau, or I call this a bateau neckline. Okay. Because um, it's not too wide. So, yes, so speak to that because yeah. I will just say well, I, think, you can I find see it, it so flattering and so pretty and as I move sometimes it wants to do this kind of like almost drapey thing. Mm -hmm. It's just but I'm with you. I don't like a, a boat neckline that's too wide and it just it feels awkward. Yeah, to me when you're talking about a boat neckline it's like goes from almost shoulder seam to mm -hmm, shoulder mm -hmm, seam. Mm -hmm. So I'm calling, I call these a bateau neckline because it's modified. It, it still gives you the decollete coverage you want, mm -hmm. but it, it, it does show that pretty part around your neck. Totally. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so uh, you're going to see on Crystal and she's paired it just with some great pants. I think those might be the knit twill that are coming up, but don't hold yes, me to it. Yes, that's it. Yes. Um, yes. The length is great. And if there's one thing that I think Denim and Company does so incredibly well. And it's not the obvious, which is your price points are insanely good. Your quality is insanely good for the insanely good price points. Um, people call in and say, you know, that, that they've had Denim and Company items for literally years and years and years. They never fade, they don't pill, like it's incredible. But for instance, a, a Denim and Company brand t-shirt uh, which again, we call this a top because it's almost so much more than just a tee. You're getting the kind of length that traditional brick and mortar wouldn't give you. Um, so it's giving you some coverage, it's giving you some modesty, and it's giving you a really beautiful 
silhouette and profile. So if you are wearing um, a skinny jean or a legging or taking you into fall, this is not the traditional top that stops right at your natural waistline. It's just so flattering, Gary. Well, and the other thing to, to consider too is, what is it, August 20th maybe? Yeah, Am yeah. I correct? 19, 19. 19? Uh -huh. So um, doesn't really get super cold until maybe you know, end of October. Mm -hmm. So you have a lot of time to wear something like this on its own, but you also need layering pieces. You need things like this to wear under cardigans, to wear under denim jackets, to wear under blazers. And a lot of times I hear from the fans out there, they don't want like two long sleeves fighting with each other. Agreed. So this is a three quarter sleeve, which is fa your favorite um, and easily it, it, it's an easy piece to wear under something if you choose to do that. Now, here's the other thing, Sean. There's a large part of the country who lives in warm weather, right? Yeah, for sure. Year round. Mm -hmm. And so if you live in Florida and Texas and Arizona and Southern California and places like that, oh my gosh, you'll wear this all the time. All the time. The colors are just dynamite. I also, I do love a textured knit or mm -hmm. what I often call a slub knit, but Gary's right. Most slub is see-through and really lightweight, but I love the texture story. I think it looks tremendously designer. I think it looks really interesting. Um, I just think it elevates the visual. Mm -hmm. So in some of these lighter colors, you really can see what I'm talking about. Like this is your peach sorbet. This is your natural. Um, those striations that are beautifully built into the knit and texturize it. And then keep in mind, natural not, is not optic white. Um, then we move into our light turquoise. There's that clay red, the black that I'm in. And then Gary is holding that dark spruce green. We purposely, with almost 900 of these ordered, put this on both an easy pay and a buy more and save that make loading up on more than one really easy. Um, because this will be a staple in a fall wardrobe when you are layering, let alone even wearing it just now as a standalone piece. So under cardigans, under leather jackets, under dusters, under puffer vests, under denim jackets, this is a winner. And yet you are gonna lose your chance on the buy more and save, which saves you three bucks. So now if you pick up more than one, it's not $39 after the first one, it's 36. But all of that, that juicy stuff on your screen that you see that make it really so inviting expires at the end of today. I feel like, Sean, the textured part of this, I mean, I love a good, smooth jersey knit. Like, it's always perfect, right? But I feel like the texture part of these, these knits give this like a really kind of updated contemporary look. You know what I mean? Like a little bit more, um, I, I think youthful yes. is a good word. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I think we all want to feel and look youthful, right? I don't think there's anything wrong with that. But this head just has that kind of modern contemporary edge to it For because sure. of the texture. Gary, um, a slight pivot, but I'm just curious to know, a fall flavor or smell that you are looking forward to? Well, I love anything pumpkin. That's no surprise. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, I was actually at a store today, Sean, and uh, the store has a lot of home stuff. Uh -huh. And they happen to have a lot of fall candles in. <gasps> and I'm uh -huh. standing there going, oh, that's really good. <laughs> Oh, I love that too. I, know, I mean, I am testing every candle in this store. It's a wonder I didn't get thrown out. No. I, <laughs> no. It's but I think that's what you're supposed to do, thousand right? thousand percent. Yeah. And I'm all so, about that. The yeah. nutmegs and the pumpkins yeah. and the spices and the currants. Of course, I wouldn't let anybody get around, you know, to smell the candles too, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> they could come back later. But, I'm, but, but there were things like, wait, there were things like white pumpkin. That Isn't smell that delicious. Clever, right? And things like um, falling leaves. And I almost bought the falling leaves one because it, you know, there's sometimes when you smell something, you're like, oh, that's it. That's it. It was so good. But I don't, I usually don't burn candles. You I, don't? Get, I get luminaire. I like luminaire that don't. What's a oh, luminaire? Luminara? luminara. luminara. Just, you don't burn candles? No. Really? No. No. Hmm. I don't want to. I don't want to set my house on fire. I understand. <laughs> I was going to probe. It felt too probing, 
and personal to ask a follow-up, but I was curious, but see, thank you for sharing. You're welcome. Um, all right, well, listen, I burn candles 24-7, so feel free to swing by my pad okay. if you need a little bit of your burning okay. candle fix. Okay, all right. Um, okay, but guys, back to the... Note to self, Christmas present for Sean. That's right, and didn't you just <laughs> move recently? I did. Yeah, a thousand of these out the door. Um, ha have you fully unpacked? Or no. Like, no. <laughs> yeah. okay. No. That's a big no. I have not fully unpacked. Yes, I know. It takes forever. It's a nice, it's a nice thing, isn't it, moving? It's a special experience. <laughs> it's really <laughs> a lot. Um, I, okay. like, I like how you put that. <laughs> so um, these are brand spanking new today. You are seeing them on a buy more and save an easy pay that will no longer be the case or the opportunity when this day is done. And we purposely, if we brought you fleece joggers and then that cute blanket cardigan, we needed to complete the outfit and give you the layering top that goes under it. So black, Gary is holding oh, sorry. Uh, dark spruce green, mm -hmm. clay red, light turquoise, natural, and peach sorbet. And I definitely would pick up at least one of those if you can. Oh, gosh. 